Hi guys, Rose here with the Cackling Moon. This is going to be an unboxing video. Um, where's my water? I had a water bottle, like I could feel my throat. Oh. I can feel my throat start to get a little bit raw. Oh my gosh, I just don't wanna be sick anymore. Um, <laughs> so I have an unboxing, an unboxing video for you guys. Guess what came in the mail today? So if you follow me on Instagram, you will probably have seen the post where I put out where I was asking everybody if they had this deck and they wanted to sell it, please let me know. So I've been wanting this deck forever and it is the Vampire Tarot by Robert M. Place. Um, it's out of print and if you look on eBay for it, it's usually always $200. I've seen them on eBay for like $220, $225. I'm like, that's a lot of money for a deck. Um, and so I put the thing out there and then I was contacted by somebody which who just so, so happened to be the same person who I bought the first edition um, Radiant uh, Oracle of the Radiant Sun. So I bought the deck from her and so she contacted me. I don't know how this woman gets all of these out of print decks, but she contacted me and she said um, she's she's selling the deck and if I wanted it, it, I could have it. She doesn't live that far from me, so it got here literally within a day after she shipped it, which was nice because I knew I was gonna be home for it. Um, and so I got my hands on the Vampire Tarot. I wanted this deck because one, it's vampires, two, we're in hall, like vampire season. <laughs> fall season but also because it's just always been on my wish list I freaking love how it matches my nails <laughs> and also I just feel like I lucked out because it's the box set it has everything and she's a really sweet woman and I bought from her before so I know she's not just gonna take my money and run so it was really cool she um she she sold it to me and so um how much did i pay for it 140 so i paid 140 which is a lot it's a lot of money i'm sure some of you guys are like oh my god how could you spend 140 dollars on a deck of cards because i love tarot <laughs> that's why and also because it's out of print and i just respect that and because i've seen the other things come up on ebay for like 200 plus dollars so 140 was like a deal in my opinion um so anyways Let's open this baby up. Let's open it up. So I love the box. Nice, sturdy box. Also, if my husband comes home and you hear noise and all that stuff, it's him. He went out to eat with a friend, and so I don't know when he's coming back, but chances are he's gonna come back while I'm doing this video. Oh my God! <laughs> okay, so she told me that the cover had a little, um, fold in it which is fine no big deal but it comes with the, the guidebook which I've been watching like reviews on the deck and stuff because that's what I do when I obsess over something I look it up um and so a lot of people were saying like they really enjoy the um the review the the guidebook so I'm gonna have to you know dive right in and read it oh my gosh <laughs> so the other half of the book has the the section for the cards to go in and she shrinked wrapped. Well, not really shrink wrapped, but she wrapped them. So the thing about this deck, you guys, is one, it's large, like it's oracle size. And two, the edges are square, which I am not a fan of. And I'm also like one of those crazy people that will mod her deck. So I will totally be modding this. Some of you guys are probably cringing because if you collect tarot, and especially if it's an out of print deck, it's like you would never touch it like and ruin it, right? I'm I mean, I'm not saying I'm ruining it, but I'm not I'm also not gonna I'm also gonna use it. Like I don't collect the cards just so that they could sit on my thing and look pretty. Like I'm gonna read with a sucker. <laughs> so um I'm definitely planning on modding the deck. Um I think what I'm gonna do is cut the borders off and round the edges um and the only reason why i say that is because one of the reviews one of the one of the deck videos that i saw with this deck where the person was showing the cards they actually modded their deck too so they took off the white borders and they rounded the edges and it looked amazing so 
I think I'm just gonna do it. Um, so these are the backs of the cards. It's the the alien, alien, it's the vampire. And it can go either which way, so it could be, you know, upright or reversed. Um, the cards are glossy, so they are glossy, and they are huge. They're big. Look at how big that is. I mean, come on. So pretty much if I were to deck mod it, if I were to take these borders off, the cards themselves would probably be still larger than tarot. Like that's the Halloween tarot. Yeah, it would be just a little bit, just a little bit bigger than the tarot, which is fine with me, but this is huge. So I think I'm going to do that. So I'll have to do a video where I show you guys, maybe not the process of me deck modding, but the aftermath. <laughs> so this is the cards. King of Holy Water. <laughs> I freaking love it. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, she put it in order for me. Queen of Holy Water. Oh my God. Look at who is it, you guys? Who is it? If you love tarot, you'll know exactly who this is. Miss Pamela Coleman Smith herself. Oh my God. I didn't even know she was in this deck. Knight of Holy Water, Joseph Sheridan Lefon. Lefon, Lefon, I don't know, I don't know how to say it. I'm not gonna show you guys every card, but <laughs> I freaking love it. Oh my God. Okay, I'm just dying. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm dropping everything. Mina, look at her little bite marks. So the cards do go um, after Dracula. So if you're familiar with Dracula, then you'll know. Look at that creepy count I am so happy right now Van Helsing is in there look at the lovers <sighs> sexy sexy oh my gosh the hermit that's so creepy oh yeah these cards are gonna look so good without those white borders for sure the strength with the little werewolf <laughs> Oh my God, the madman. Look at how creepy he looks. <laughs> I'm totally into this. I'm digging it. The devil. Oh my gosh. So yeah, um, I'm really excited. I'm really happy. And I'm just, I just, I love it. I'm glad that I own it now. Yes. So my copy is going to be with me forever and ever. Um, so that's why I'm going to deck mod it. Because this is not a deck that I plan on reselling and getting money for. This is mine to keep forever. I plan on reading with it. I plan on using it, especially this season. So I don't know. I might be like going out to buy because the I watch what's her name. I don't know her name, but Boho Boho Tarot. Oh, my God. If you guys don't follow them on YouTube, she posts a lot of her deck modding videos and she has a paper cutter thingy, like one of the smaller ones. And so I'm like, I need to get my hands on that because anytime I've done a deck mod in the past, I use my own hands and I cut, which I don't think, no, I didn't. I almost, I almost cut the borders off of these cards, but I didn't. Um, actually, my wisdom of the house of night was square borders, just like this deck. And I ended up rounding them I just think the rounded edges look so much better than square. It's just, I don't know. They're just pokey. Like, I don't want a square deck. I want a round one. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, I'm not afraid of deck modding. I love it. It's To me, it's like I throw on some music and I just go to town. I think this deck would look so cute with black, um, black edges or even red but I won't do that until after I cut the borders off. So yeah, I just think that this is gonna look so cute. Um, so I'll have to show you guys an update on my deck once I do it. Oh, look at it. I'm so happy and love this. Ooh, look at the aces, the swords are, um, is this the swords? I think it's the swords. Oh no, maybe not. There's knives and then there's the stakes which is wands, and then there's freaking garlic. <laughs> there's garlic, that's so funny. Okay, I just, I love it, I'm in love, I'm happy. <laughs> okay, yeah, so definitely gonna have to deck mod this and then post pictures and show it off. If any of you guys have 
the vampire tarot and you deck modded it, I want to see pictures. Like, show me. So send it to me. Show me pictures and stuff. Um, but anyways, that is my little video to show you guys the vampire tarot. I put out a thing that I wanted it not even a week ago and I already own it now. So I'm happy. <sighs> I'm just happy. So yeah. Okay, you guys, I'm going to go now. I will talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye.